You guys don't know where I've been. I don't even know where I've been. But here I am. And uh, just want to say that hopefully make this a permanent thing again. We can be friends again. Okay. So if you abandoned me already, well, I deserve that. <laughs> Here I am. For the 10th, 11th, maybe the 15th time. There I am. There's a lot of games I missed out on. Basically, like when I was back on YouTube, I was playing more like uh, shooters. A lot of shooting games. I did a lot of live streams. We played a lot of COD. Fortnite, Apex, Hunker, Among Us. Oh my God, the Among Us days, guys. The Among Us days. Uh, and and we did a little bit of Fall Guys too. We we went all out. Okay, things were things were good. You know what I mean? But life happened. Life happened, and uh, it does things to people. And um, but like I said, I'm back. Okay, I think I'm back. I think I'm back. But this is a start, okay? And uh, I'm feeling a lot better and things are going well. And uh, some of you guys checked up on me and everybody, to all of my fans who checked up on me, like like when I was in like the worst of moments, like you, you guys came out of nowhere. Like, what's up, Icarus? Like, what's wrong, bro? Like, where are you? Like, you, I appreciate you guys so much, man. Like, it, the support was crazy. Like I was like, "Oh my god, seriously!" But um, <laughs> here I am. So I'm missing out on this series called uh, Poppy Playtime. I'm missing out on it apparently. Um, so okay, technically I'm not. Technically, off camera, I did play the first part of it. So your boy still was out here playing some video games, all right? And I just wasn't showing you guys. I Stupid, you know what I mean? But I played the first part of it. So I know what's gonna happen in the first part of it. But part two came out. And I don't know what's gonna happen in part two of it. But for the people, some of my fans who don't know what Poppy Playtime is, I wanted to go ahead and play it again, the first part. So don't expect me to be like all scared of stuff. I ain't no, I'm a veteran. Anyway, to part one anyway. I'm gonna go in here and play part one. You guys are gonna be here, maybe. And you know, I just wanna show you guys what the game's about before we go into part two together, okay? So, I don't know if I'm gonna get all the tapes, but you know what I mean? I think I'm just gonna run through. If you wanna see, I know the camera's shaky, but like, happens okay it's connected to my table anytime i touch my table camera shakes see watch this <laughs> it's really good for like getting angry and just no but anyway um yeah we're just gonna run through the game this is the creepy thing that i honestly don't know what he wants from me but he's always after you so I'm gonna go to new game. We're gonna start from there and you guys are gonna hopefully enjoy this, so. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her, Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe? Just watch. Poppy Playtime! Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect! Thank you! Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it. 
and smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl, just like you. What's the time? Playtime! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can't... After watching a video like that, there's no way you're getting my ass into your factory. That's a cursed tape. Everyone thinks the staff disappeared 10 years ago. We are still here. Find the flower. So that's everything I found. A vintage uh, tape of it, which I watched and, and, and completely shat myself. And I still... Still walked up in here though, you know what I mean? I just I don't give two shits. Okay. Okay, green tape. There we go. Tab to view items. Hi, my name is Late Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. Tab to view if items. Seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we played this little tape on loop whenever we closed the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. No spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. This man just said to you, go in there if you want, okay? The police are on the way. <laughs> but they, they ain't gonna find you alive. That's basically what he just said, all right? You can turn back now while the police are, are on the way, you know what I mean? Green, pink, yellow, red. Okay, that's how you do that. Oh, you you guys want to look around here? There's nothing to see. That there's that, and there's blood coming out of that. Like that's that's just weird, right? Okay, so I don't remember being able to run when I played it last time, or maybe I always I could always run. I just didn't notice. Wait, what were the colors again? I don't remember. Okay, so the colors were yellow, pink. No, what, what am I doing? Green, pink, red. Green, pink, yellow, red. <laughs> Green, pink, yellow, red. All right, all right, all right, all right. Here we go. Green, pink, yellow, red. Awesome. Okay, blue tape. Let me get nice and cozy. Oh, a grab pack. Yes, tighten the straps. Yes, 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 yes. Hold both cannons. Full trigger to fire. Will the cannon retract? Hold to grip into objects. Okay. Only fire at small objects. Handles. Do not fire at coworker. Woo -hoo -hoo. That's more than an injury. Wire is conducting. Use for rewiring. But yeah, there you have it. When you see this, all right, when you start seeing these, don't use them on people. Okay. So I got the blue hand, and now apparently I can just jump over here. And I did this last time. So you do that. I suddenly feel like my audio may be a little higher than it was. So I might have to turn that down. Da da da. da, da, da. What am I saying? What am I saying? We're going in here full effect, man. We're gonna we're gonna have 
All the full effects of this Poppy's Playhouse madness. All right, play time. Play time. Okay. All right. So then out of nowhere, a key is in his hand. I grab that and I don't even suspect the thing. I just grab it. You know, and I just look at this guy and I'm just like, you know, I could tell he's moving. You know, I could see like his uh, his fur move a little bit as I get closer, but I'm, I'm just not gonna pay attention to that. I'm gonna open up the power room. Staff only. All right, do's, don'ts, you know, you know, you know, we don't follow rules. Rules are meant to be broken. All right, so open that up, grab that. Everything's so loud though this time around. I'm, I'm highly considering turning my volume up down. <laughs> I really uh, uh, see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then next thing you know, this guy's gone. Like, that's it for him. He's gone, bro. It says hug. It says huggy right there. Okay. So now you go over to the door that you were supposed to open, right? Open that up. And then next thing you know, look at that. Look at who he had that. Oh, see, I tried to give him a high five before he went away, but he, he, uh, disappeared pretty quickly. <gasps> Bro, you can see her, her, you can see her reflection on the door as you're walking up. It kind of spooked me a little bit. So this is the stairway to hell. So what you do is, uh. You know, if they would kindly let me in. Yep. Yeah. That happens as well, you know. A lot of a lot of noises try to scare you as you're walking through and uh, go through this door. I'm sorry. I, I, you guys are looking at me right now like this guy is just like, he's just not scared. There's no rea real reaction because I'm not afraid I, i've already done it like probably twice now <laughs> so i'm just telling you guys what's going on like all to all my people my peeps who don't know what this game is about or what's going on i'm showing you basically what we got going on here and then we're gonna move on to part two okay where i don't know what's going on and you don't know what's, hopefully don't know what's going on <laughs> And then at that time, you know, things are gonna get rough for, for the both of us. For the both of us. I'll go ahead and get all the tapes since I know where they're all at. So let's just grab all of them while I can, right? Okay, so I think there's one up there. And then I think there's one like in, uh, ooh, let's see, run around this way. There's a tape, there should be a tape right here. Okay, yeah, I got that. Got that tape. Wasn't there another one? Like, there it is, right there. It's red. Okay, there's a yellow one here on the floor. And there's another one here. I don't feel like the locations of these changed up. Like, I don't feel like these were there before, but okay. Okay. I just leave all the doors open, in all honesty. Actually, I don't know if that's a good idea. In scary games in general, that's what I mean. Rich, where are they keeping the huggy boxes? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Remember when maintenance last did a sweep of this place? <laughs> no. Exactly. Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. I get it. It's a nice program at on brand. Uh, it's just hard to be happy about it when manufacturing's on our necks about it, because we can't buy stupid hockey boxes. Rich. Uh, you're right. You're right. It's, it's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. If anything less would be more habitable. Is, is that even a word? Habitable. Okay. 
Alright, uh, so that happened for you guys, and, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put these in here. There we go. And it's just so loud. It's all so loud. It's so, it's so loud, guys. There we go. Now we get our other hand. And now we're dually willed. Dually willed boy opens this door here. And we're good. We're good to go. This part's loud as hell, guys. Okay, I'm trying to remember how this actually goes. So I think I go up here. Then I hit it. And then I go over here around that there we go just like that easy <laughs> easy Okay, now I'm in this room, okay? That's creepy, that's creepy, that's creepy. And I guess that's creepy. But anyway, um, so now I'm in this room, right? And in this room, I think I gotta go upstairs. Not mistaken. Okay. I don't remember how this one works, as a matter of fact. Okay, what if I come over here and then I look over here? There it is. Okay, that's the pink tape. Let me just go play the pink tape real quick while we're here. Like, while I'm here, you know? So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world a great feeling and being able to work at a toy factory somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience that's a pretty great feeling too sometimes though i really really wish i could go back to being a kid i mean and it's weird because adults are just kids but older i don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult but your body just gets older and older and then you die. <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's things though, like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than the person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something, right? All right, I think we're getting a little off track. <laughs> That guy was definitely weird out. I'm gonna tell you that now. He was. All right, how do you do this? I'm sure it goes like this. And it goes like that. Uh, I can't remember. Uh, okay, okay. So you come over here. You pull that here, right? No, 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 Oh. That scared. I'm not gonna like. I didn't like hanging like that. That was so weird. That was the weirdest thing ever, man. Okay. 
Alright, alright, come around this way. Alright, we're... The same routine. <laughs> Grab this. Try not to fall next time, because everything looked a little weird. Kinda, kinda blurred my vision a bit as well. Okay, go around here, just like that. And your boy done figured it out. Just like that, everything is started. Okay, so that happens, and then after you press that. Okay. All right. So now you gotta you gotta pull this right here. Then pull that one. Then pull that. So creepy. It's all, it's all just so creepy, bro. I'm telling you guys right now, man. But this is the future, guys. Machines literally doing all the work for us. All right, give me that. That's mine. And uh, so basically what you do is you take that. And let's see. Nobody leaves without a toy. Okay. Scan that. Then you just go into this room here. But this motherfucker comes out. And he's the biggest thing you've ever seen in your life. And he, he keeps walking up to you. And I don't actually remember how to get out of it. I think I know how to get out of here. Like easy. Okay. Then they're coming at you. Then this man really comes at you. Like that. Okay. You just keep running. You don't look back. You don't look back. Looking back is probably the creepiest thing you could do. That man's gonna literally be right behind you. Oh my God, which way? Okay, this way, <laughs> that part gets me every time, bro, I'm telling you right now, man. And then after that, right here, he's literally right behind you, so don't look back. You turn in here, grab that, pull that bitch. <laughs> and that's blood. That is blood right, that's how you end that, folks. Um, so you go this way. No, you don't go that way. You go this way. And I think the tape's right here. Uh-oh. Okay. So I said I wasn't gonna do all the tapes, but I did all the tapes, there you go. <sighs> Last tape. He definitely died. He definitely died. Can I actually jump off? Cause I I kind of got rid. Oh my god! See, I don't like the way that. Oh my! I'm not even gonna try it. Um. Can I grab that? No. All right, that's fine. The setting is just so different here. But it's beautiful. I love it. Kinda. You know what I mean? Like, it's so peaceful in here, you know? But this game 
It's pretty cool. It's pretty crazy. It's, I'll admit that. You know what I mean? Like, I just love how you can grab whatever. Like, that's so cool. You know? I don't, however, like how all this is red here. <laughs> yep, look, alright. I'm not here to see you. We don't have enough pillows for the couch in the living room. So don't mind me. I'm not even gonna come in the room. I just kinda... I guess I'm going in the room. I guess I'm going in the room! Well, there's only one thing left to do. And, uh, let's open this case here. So, basically, we're just gonna open this, and, uh, that's it. You opened my case. You gotta, you gotta admit, it's not bad. It's freaking good. It actually is. It's kind of, bro, that atmosphere was, was great. It was awesome. Part two is out. <laughs> and we're going to be doing part two. And I don't know if I'm ready. Cause like, I see, I know part one, but like part two, man. And I just want to say again, man, thank you guys for just, I don't know, just being around, you know what I mean? Like, I didn't never think I'd get back on here, but here I am. I'm still a nobody right now, you know? Or maybe I am somebody, but you know, my head just, insecurities, I, I don't know. But I do love you guys, man, seriously. Thank you for coming in here. It's been a really long time uh, for any of you who see this anyway. And um, I love you guys. And I'll see you guys on another video. Peace out.